22 days. Yeah. And you prepared for a speech. Yeah. Yeah. Very impressive. <laughs> <laughs> Knowing myself, I know that would not have been an option. I probably even wouldn't be here, probably be stressing about someone not delivering something on time. So, mm -hmm. excellent job. I'll begin with what I saw. As you sat down and began your monologue, you were expressive. When you were sad, it was visible in your voice, in your facial expression, and the dry humor was just hilarious. If someone would have not known you or what you're talking about, they would have sat there and thought, oh my God, she's cold. But it, it, it wasn't that, it was very dry humor, which was, you played out fantastic. The monologue work, it was excellent. Um, it was very well played, it was very well dramatized. Um, and I know you said it was a poem, but you're presenting it seemed more like a conversation with someone than it was a poem, but it did play out extremely well. When you emailed, you said the things that you want to pay attention to are audible pauses, and you want to pay attention to your stance and your posture, and then you did say that you'd be using notes. Using notes is not a bad thing. Uh, any time when you go for a formal presentation, it probably helps you. And especially when you have everything else that's going on to help prepare for this speech. And I know you picked it up last meeting as a last minute help to Greg. So it's not like you've been preparing this for a long time. You also had a very short time to prepare for it. And then you have work and you have your wedding and all this other stuff. So using notes is not a bad thing. And when you use them, you use them as a point of reference. And then you went back to your speech. You still had your eye contact, you still interacted with everyone comfortably. At no point were you doing this. It, you were comfortable with your notes. And even when you read them, your voice was still projecting, you were still audible. Your voice has a very slight quiver at the end. I'm still not sure if it's because of the nerves and being in front here or it's just your voice. If it is because of nerves, that wears out with time. Um, the more speeches you give, the more comfortable you get speaking, then that tremor, that kind of fear, that nervousness almost goes away. Your stance was very comfortable. When you sat down, the dramatization was great. When you stood, you were in place, you did not pace. I think you thought you usually pace a little bit, you did not. You were in place, you used your hands every once in a while, you used your notes, and then you brought your hands back home, so it was very comfortable. Overall, you did a fantastic job. The only thing I'll always remind you is when you make a mistake, don't apologize. Stop, breathe, recollect your thoughts, and then start over. Otherwise, fantastic speech. Enjoy your marriage and your wedding day.